It is an ancient sound that lives on today. Keith Baer played the flute, told folk stories bridging the historical past with the present, and shared great traditions at the American Indian Cultural Celebration at the Nelson Atkins Museum of Art in Kansas City. It's the present day embodiment of uh, traditions that are very, very old. Bear brought several of the more than 40 flutes he has crafted, each with its own sound. He says he listens with his heart to learn different techniques. And then you learn different techniques. By, I learned all mine by listening to nature, the wind in my windows and through the plastic and, and through the screen door and through the grass and through the trees outside. Uh, the birds and the bees and the bugs and all of these things and the coyotes. And, you know, so whatever I hear is what I try to imitate. And, Kirkwood Hall was the centerpiece of the celebration. But this is a way, I think an increasingly vital way, for Native peoples to stay in touch with their cultural traditions and to connect with other Native peoples. The Royal Valley Native American singers performed contemporary dances that reflect older tribal traditions and some that date back to Buffalo Build Wild West shows. Master of Ceremonies Manny King says the more children who participate, the better. I think they carry again, they carry on our traditions. They, uh, they are our future and we look to them, uh, you know, and someday we're, we're going to be too old, we're not going to be able to do this anymore, you know, and we're going to turn around and we're going to say, hey, you need, to, you need to take this on, this is your responsibility. In keeping with Native American protocol, Keith Bear asked permission to dance with Royal Valley. The drumbeat is constant in these dances. It is truly the heartbeat of Native culture. A high point of the afternoon was the hoop dance, a storytelling dance that incorporates hoops. They create dynamic formations representing animals, shapes, and storytelling elements. The hoop symbolizes the never-ending circle of life, relatable to any culture. They join in something that is common to all, and it forges a connection, I think, uh, within Native American communities, and it also is a way for Native peoples to communicate their traditions to non-Indians, to people outside the culture. For the Nelson Atkins Museum of Art, I'm Kathleen Layton.